हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू सुरेश अग्रवाल्स मैथमेटिक्स शॉर्टकट्स सम ट्रिक्स इन मल्टीप्लिकेशन आर यू नो रेयरली यूज्ड एंड दे फाइंड सो मच ऑफ एप्लीकेबिलिटी इन सो मेनी प्रॉब्लम्स वन ऑफ द वेरी वेरी प्रोमिनेंट ट्रिक व्हिच आई यूज इज द फैक्टराइजेशन दैट मींस ब्रेकिंग अप अ नंबर इनटू इट्स स्मॉल फैक्टर्स इन मेंटल मैथ्स you know this trick finds so much of applicability and you need to watch the complete video i'm going to do a five digit number by a five digit number using this trick and i'll tell you how this works so wonderfully well so watch the entire video to learn something very useful and if you have not yet clicked the subscribe button please do it now this is all for you and along with the subscription you need to click the bell shaped icon so that you keep on getting all the notifications of this useful uploads on this amazing channel and if you want a collection of all these short tricks 350 such short tricks which make you a genius which increases the aptitude and helps you in being among those 1% students who qualify all sorts of competitions then the ebook of short tricks is for you so this is a very very nominal costing ebook which can be uh, obtained by sending me a message on whatsapp 9896369963 you can find this number in the description also here and i'll let you know how to get a copy of that right okay so let me tell you about the concept of splitting it into uh, splitting a particular number into its factors by taking some simple examples and in the next slide i'm going to do a five digit number by a five digit number okay here i go now suppose there is a complicated number like say 73 and i need to multiply this by 4 see uh, most of us will be able to do it mentally but i am going to focus on the trick first not the calculation so i know that multiplication by 4 you need four times table but if i know the concept of doubling then multiplication by 2 is quite easy right so i know that 4 is 2 times 2 so i just have to double this so 73 73 146 and then double again we get 140 is 280 and 6 is 12 so 292 which is will be our answer now all these steps are mental math steps okay these are not to be written likewise the tables are not required if the number can be factorized and it's not a prime number like uh, the number 18 how about taking 18 suppose i have to do uh, say 47 and times 18 now the situation is little bit more complicated now right because you need to know 18 times table but if i know that 18 can be broken down as twice thrice thrice this is 18 right now the double of 47 is 94 so i just have to do 3 times 3 now 90 is 270 triple right i am multiplying by 3 and 4 is 12 270 plus 12 is 282 now i have to do another triple 28 the triple is 84 and 2 the triple is 6 and there we go 846 is the result now you can check using the calculators i don't think you are going to fumble anywhere okay now this is the concept right now watch the beauty of this mathematics uh, trick i'm going to take a, a big number and i'm going to try to multiply it by another big number right so the question which i am taking is say 28128 and i need to multiply that by 10625 10625 now either i can bring this into its factor or break this into its factors it's my choice now so i'll try this because uh, this will be divisible by 2 this will be divisible by 5 so if i break this into factors you will find that the factors of this particular number will be so many fives will automatically be there so this is practically 5 times 5 times 5 times 5 times 17 now you can check i already made the factor so that i can save time and once you know the factors of this number job done how do i do it now 
See, I can keep on multiplying this number by fives simultaneously and getting on to 17 in the end. But I am at 25 directly. 5 times 5 is 25, right? How do you multiply a number by 25? 2, 8, 1, 2, 8. Multiply by 25 means 25. So, okay, this is 25. So, I need to just write 25 here. And now, I need to find out a way to multiply this number by 25 easily. So, I will do upon 4 into 4. This is 100. So, 2, 8, 1, 2, 8, double 0. And divide by 4 means taking the half twice. So, this is 1, 4, 0, 6, 4, 0, 0. And another one, 7, 0, 3, 2, 0, 0. Now, this is the product of 2, 8, 1, 2, 8 by 25. 7, 0, 3, 2, double 0. Now, 7, 0, 3, 2, double 0. Again, I have to do it by another 25. So, see, these are all mental math steps, you know. I don't have to write anything. Don't think that I am writing so many steps in, instead of that you can do the traditional mathematics. This is not something to be written. This is something to be thought in the mind. Okay. Now, I have to do another 25. So, what will I do? 7, 0, 3, 2, 0, 0. Put two more zeros and divide it by 4 again. So, this becomes half of this is 3, 5, 1, 6 and 4 zeros. And half of this is 1, 7, so 34, 1, 1 means 5 and 1, 6 means 8, 1, 7, 5, 8 and 4 zeros, right? So I'll do this by 17 first and then put 4 zeros. I should remember that I have to put 4 zeros, okay? Now multiplication by 17 is another trick. How do I do it? See, 8, 7s are 56, so I'll write a 56 here. Uh, 5 7s are 35, 35 plus 8 is 43, 7 7s are 49 plus 5 is 54, 1 7s are 7 plus 7 is 14 and finally the 1. So what do I get? 6, 5 carried 48 means 8, 4 carried 58 means 8, 5 carried 19 means 9, 1 carried 2 and how many zeros? 4 zeros. 1, 2, 3, 4. Now pick up the calculators and tell me 28128 8 times 10625. Is it 29886 0000? And you are going to be surprised that the answer for the question is such an accurate one. Okay, so you know how this trick works. You don't have to do five digit by five digit in any exam, right? You will have to do like three digit numbers, two digit numbers. Even single digit numbers like I have done uh, uh, on the previous slide if you see and go back to that I did 4 here. Small things. We need to practice the small things. I just told you a 5 digit number by 5 digit number to tell you the beauty of the mathematics method. Okay friends. So should, if you want I can give you a DIY question. You can post it in the comments whether you got the correct answer for this or not. Okay. For this the question is. You can do 18776 which is a big number and you can multiply that by 10625 and let me know in the comments what is the answer for this question and uh, how much time did you take to solve this question okay right so if you like this video of uh, splitting the number any one number uh, out of the two numbers to be multiplied into factors and then multiplying then share this video with all your friends so that they can also enjoy the beauty of mathematics and all the best for this question.